Good evening folks, this is Danny at Bradley James Classics and I'm bringing you today a video of, in my humble opinion, one of the most beautiful cars in the world ever made. And this is a Jaguar 420G from 1968. The car had been a car in regular daily use. A gentleman from North London owned this car for many years. There is a vast stack of service history uh, which comes with the vehicle that shows some fairly extensive restoration work that was done uh, which included a rebuilt engine gearbox axle the car does have uh, a high torque starter motor it does have a electric cooling fan and better gearing in the back axle for um, long distance driving with a better ratio the bodywork is immaculate, it's mason black with red leather interior. The bodywork is stunning, it's rock solid underneath, it's all fully under sealed and the chrome work is in very nice condition, albeit not as new of course. The car is now 53 years old and to find one in black with red leather and bodywork this good and a beautiful engine and box. Um, the car starts on the button, it drives superbly well, no issues. Um, it's crying out to just be used. Uh, I'm a bit biased because this is probably one of my favorite cars. I've always loved the Jaguar Mark 10 and the 420G. There's only a few differences between a Mark 10 and a 420G and those in the know will know, but certainly that stripe right down the middle is the first clue. Um, there's a clock which is positioned high up on the dashboard on a G and we have a little strip down the middle of the radiator and they're the main visuals that you can usually tell the two cars apart. Obviously the registration is a is a clue because of uh, the year in which 420 G's come out. Now I'm gonna show you the bodywork up close and it is gleaming in the early evening sun. I'm making this video at the beginning of the summer. And as you can see from my walk around, she is absolutely gleaming. The car has recently uh, had some use in the film TV industry. So it's recently been through our workshop and we've had a quite a large internal bill just to iron out any small issues from having been in storage for a little while but she is running absolutely sweetly uh, this rebuilt engine is powerful and smooth starts on the button and it will drive you anywhere you want to go small things battery with an isolator the battery's brand new the tires are all matching in an excellent condition she's rock solid underneath and i hope you can see from my walk around video just how nicely she presents. Uh, look how nice she is in the boot. Let me just pull that up and show you. And here is that boot space, huge of course. Room for a few extra passengers, if you know what I mean. And um, considering the age of the vehicle, I mean, it's absolutely stunning in here. Lovely to say that the uh, original jack is in situ, as is the spare wheel. Sadly missing the toolbox, which used to sit about there. Um, simply stunning condition, um, a real credit to its previous owner. We love this car. Stainless steel exhaust, as you can see poking out there. Let's shut this uh, boot down. I mean, it's similarly lovely underneath the engine bay, and you'll see from the old receipts that when the car was fully resprayed that included the engine coming out and uh, all painted on the inner wings lovely clean engine um, again a real credit I've got some photographs of the engine bay separately now the one area that you could invest in to take to the next level is that the interior is very usable but to make her as lovely as the outside um, well, this is actually quite nice through here, but as you can see, we've lost some of the um, 
some of the varnishing that's down to bare wood here where it's lost some of the varnishing. This door card is in beautiful condition, electric window model. Look how lovely these carpets and carpets mats are. These seats show their age, even though they have been fed. Um, we can see there's some lacquer off of the wood here. However, these back parcel shelves work perfectly well. And there's that little built-in mirror. In fact, where that hasn't been in the sun, that's been guarded quite nicely. Um, it's a perfect headlining in this car that I believe was quite freshly done before we had it. And in fact, the paintwork's only a couple of years old as well. Um, seats, again, they show their age, uh, but they are perfectly serviceable as is. Um, there is a little bit of damage to the top of the seat here. This is where the worst effect of the sun gets them, but they are perfectly ser serviceable and usable as they are. Some of the most comfortable seats you'll ever sit in in a car. Now we've got a motor litre steering wheel, um, which actually suits the wood very nicely. And as you can see, the woodwork would ideally require some refurbishment to get it back to its former glory. But I mean, it's perfectly usable as is. Um, and it's, in fact, everything works. I mean, it's remarkable to think that uh, a car of this age uh, that's covered 128,000 miles, but that has got a full record of all its history. It's so solid in all the right areas. A total credit, as I say, to the previous owner. Um, a delightful car. These cars are rising in value, so afford one while you can. And personally, I think nothing looks nicer to see a Mark 10 Jaguar or 420G sat next to an E-Type. Possibly two of the nicest cars you'll ever see together. And I've seen that a few times. I've been quite lucky. Um, all I can really say is that this car is waiting for its new owner. It's fully up and running. I mentioned it's just gone through a fair degree of some recent recommissioning. Um, I can't really tell you a lot more other than the fact the car needs to be seen and test driven to be believed it's so silk smooth and it's nice to get a car that's actually been in regular use it makes a big difference to the way they drive while we're here i might as well pull the handle and uh show you that lovely engine bay there we go now it's quite easy to do with a jaguar you've just got a little button here you press in and up with the bonnet and as we can see, she's very lovely under here. And you can see the condition of those inner wings. They're gleaming as nicely as the outside of the car. Uh, there's our new battery. It's got it chilled in, expansion tank, just as it should be. It's, all the dash pots are clean. All this intake is. You can see the top of this uh, servo is all painted. And there's our number printed in there. It's all super clean under here. Um, certainly very worthy of heading straight to a car show with an open bonnet and people would certainly appreciate just how lovely that magnificent xk engine is now being a mark 10 of course the uh, a big difference uh, uh, th th this particular car is that we have a 4.2 engine fitted so it's the longest legs of all of the mark 10s and 420 g's obviously earlier G's um, earlier uh, Mark 10s would have had a, a 3.8 engine. Um, the gearboxes, in my opinion, on the later cars are better to live with. This one changes through the gears very nicely and certainly is powerful and uh, about as elegant as a car you're going to find on the road today. Well, I hope this video gives you a good idea of the current condition of this wonderful Jaguar. It is in stock now. It does come with a big file which shows the many, many thousands of pounds which have been spent on this vehicle. Remarkably, there is the dealer handbook. There's two sets of keys. The car has spent a lot of time being loved and this will grace any collection, any garage. It looks wonderful in any car environment um, this is the nicest driving 420 I've ever had for sale 
and we've used this on a few assignments. The BBC had it recently for some uh, for some film work, um, and it's probably known as the the villain's car being chased around with a with the cops and the robbers. But it was also a very stately car used all around the world for ferrying around dignitaries and VIPs, and um, there just simply isn't any bad angles in my opinion with these wonderful cars well she's in stock now please get in touch if you'd like to have a closer look at this wonderful jaguar we do offer transportation services of these huge heavy cars we can help you get her anywhere in the uk you need her to be or of course do what i would do come down fill both those fuel tanks off and drive her anywhere um thank you for watching the 10 minute video with me i Appreciate your time. And this is Danny at Bradley James Classics, signing out. Thank you.